Dr. Kato Lorenzen has been honored for his outstanding work in biomaterial science, stem cell technology, nanotechnology, and the new field of regenerative engineering, of which he is a founder. He was named one of the 100 engineers of the modern era by the American Institute of Chemical Engineers and has received numerous accolades, including the U.S. National Medal of Technology and Innovation, the nation's highest honor for technical achievement. In his address to an audience of mostly students and staff of the Sir Arthur Lewis Community College, Dr. Lorenzen expressed his pleasure and honor to accept the National Medal of Honor, Gold, from the government and people of St. Lucia. It is something that is, um, I believe, is a, one of the highlights of my life and my career. As you know, I've been around the world and I've met many presidents, premiers, and, and, and premiers and had a number of awards. This marks, this is an award that is very near to me because it comes from my home and my homeland. So. But receiving the Medal of Honor is also an opportunity. It's an opportunity for me to rededicate to those things that I've spoken about in terms of you know, working with the, uh, the nation of St. Lucia. Dr. Lorenzen, an engineer, physician, scientist, innovator, and a university professor, has committed to working with his homeland in three key areas, including education, youth and sports, and health sciences. As you know, I'm an orthopedic surgeon, I'm a sports medicine uh, doctor, uh, take care of uh, athletes, especially athletes in boxing and other areas. And I was very gratified to meet the head of the, uh, the Olympic Committee for St. Lucia, the Minister of Sports, and also the head of, uh, the head of boxing here at, on the island. And we've agreed to work together uh, on some projects involving youth and sports. And I think youth and sports is so, are, are so important because my belief is that if we can build biofitness and resilience, we build a stronger people and we build a stronger land. A memorandum of understanding signed between the Sir Arthur Lewis Community College and the University of Connecticut through Dr. Lorenzen is being seen as an outstanding opportunity for the college as it attempts to widen its partnerships towards achieving university status. Principal of the Sir Arthur Lewis Community College, Dr. Keith Nurse, says the initiative focuses on a wider range of initiatives, including a Just Us Moving program, also known as JUMP, a health cafe series, and an obesity physician interactive educational program. It speaks to the opportunities in terms of the usual things, uh, collaborations among staff, uh, student exchanges, and so on. But it also speaks to the issue of establishing a St. Lucia Health Sciences Initiative. I can't begin to tell you how delighted I am by that, because the health sciences is a growth area. I think we only have to look at the experience of COVID and the growth of emerging diseases to recognize that um, we are in, new, uh, in a new arena um, in terms of the global health scenario. Dr. Kato Lorenzen, here as a guest of the state with his family, also met with Minister for Education, Sustainable Development, Innovation, Science, Technology and Vocational Training, Honorable Sean Edward on Tuesday. Minister Edward thanked Dr. Lorenzen for his sterling work in the various fields of innovative science and the partnerships fostered through the Sir Arthur Lewis Community College. The minister also commended and thanked Dr. Lorenzen for donating copies of his book, Success is what you leave behind to every library on the island. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Education, Sustainable Development, Innovation, Science, Technology, and Vocational Training, I am Chris Satney, reporting.